but we have now two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Twelve. According to my record, there's twelve of you all. Alright? So anyway, yeah, my name is Vincent. Yeah. I am support I used to be the program coordinator, but this year new people, uh, Dr. Noasni took over. But anyway, yeah, so I hope you all uh, are going to enjoy the session because bear in mind when you look the word marketing, what comes to your mind? When you hear the word marketing, what comes to less than three minutes. But nowadays, you don't get uh, YouTube reels, uh, Instagram reels. How many minutes? Not even one minute. 10 seconds, 5 seconds, 15 seconds. You need to deliver all these things. So, so basically, don't be surprised that suddenly when your subject, your lecturer asks you to create an Instagram post. Then you say, hey, assignment is Instagram post, why is this? Something funny, right? No, this is common, yeah? Or sometimes, you may be asked to present your proposal to a panel of industry people. The industry people could be manager, could be CEO, could be directors. They come in and you present your ideas as an assignment. Oh, scary. Eh? But never mind, this is part and parcel that you need to learn. Alright? Even though you do not get the, the do not get the contract, no problem. At least you get the experience. So that is what we look at when it comes to Bachelor of Marketing. Alright? Marketing is to talk in terms of what, how are you going to deliver your information to your audience effectively. Yeah? Not just deliver, like now I can deliver but you don't understand what I say, so useless. So now that's very important. I still remember last time when I was your age, sitting down here, my lecturer talking, introducing uh, degree in marketing that time. You know what you're saying? Oh, don't worry, you need your presentation skill must be good. All right, your assignment must be good. That is many, many years ago. Now, a uh, different story. You need to be very uh, creative, all right, very innovative all right, in how you're going to deliver your content. All right. That's why you see last time, I remember last time when I was a student, coming to the class, we start writing notes. Now, uh, I can, can I ask you to come into class write notes? Uh? You say, oh, yeah, what is this? And then our white slide also must be very interesting, very beautiful, very nice. Last time I remember my time we used OHP. You know OHP? The, the machine here, they use the lamp to project, then they use the transparency. Yeah, right transparency, then top, move, top, move there. That time. Okay, but now everything now we use minimum is PowerPoint. But nowadays, we don't use PowerPoint so much, we use animation quite a lot, alright? So anyway, enough of that uh, brief explanation, let me just... Let me just quickly go through what is Bachelor of Marketing, then after that, your turn to talk. Right? I talk first, then your turn, uh. okay? Fair, yeah. Okay, so Bachelor of Marketing, honors. Honors, honors means that you are a degree. Okay? So what is it uh, we are looking in terms of what is the difference between sales and marketing? Alright, because most of the time people tell me, uh, yeah, Vincent, why do you need to be so specialized in marketing? Why do you need to take a marketing in MBA in marketing? Why do you need to do a PhD in marketing? Why? Marketing only what? What's so difficult? Alright? That person, if that person tells you this, you ask him to go and read back again, what is marketing? Because most of the time they mistaken for sales. Marketing nowadays is not just selling. Marketing is also talking in terms of building relationship. Alright? Preparing for sustainability of your business. Last time we buy, then I forget about you. But nowadays you buy things from me, I must remember you for as long as I can. You agree? You see? You buy one thing only the person remember you for as long as he can remember. Right? Last time I remember you buy things uh, uh, do one thing. You want you take the one, leave it, no problem. I don't care. Now you that do that to me, I just take my phone and record and share that say for no business close. Right? So that's why people misunderstand what is marketing. Sales here is part of marketing. Marketing is the whole picture. Sales is just one part of it. So basically as a marketing student, you are not only talking in terms of doing sales, you are also looking in terms of preparing your strategy, building relationship, alright? Creating the the network. You see? Like nowadays, you ask me, uh, you, do you think those Insta famous 
Facebook celebrity influencer are they marketing people? Are they marketing people? Yeah, they're just one of the marketing tools. Yeah, they are part of our marketing as well because they are there to communicate, to communicate our content to our audience. You see? So that's why nowadays people tell me marketing, why should I need to study so much marketing for what? Then that person is wrong because marketing nowadays is so wide. You know, marketing is marketing. Technology, you know technology is changing, alright? So marketing is changing together with technology. So how technology change, marketing also will change. Okay? So that's why marketing is not a dead subject, it's alive, it's changing. Whatever you learn three years later, it could be different again. That's why for me, I can never say I'm expert in marketing because we have so many things to learn. Now currently, I'm learning about analytics. Okay? How to collect data and use the data to make decision to come up with the best option for my customer. Last time when I studied as a degree student, no such thing as analytics. You know? Now there's no such thing as uh, creating your own product. Now this create product is so easy. Go to China, give your design, they'll make and they give it to you done. Nowadays we got the 3D printer. I see people do business by just do 3D printing. So any plastic parts that you miss missing, you just tell this person, this person will print it for you and that's the price to charge. Just a 3D printer can make a business. Huh? So basically marketing is very wide opportunity. If you see that where how are you going to get the opportunity? Where there's a lot of opportunity nowadays. It's just that you need to be able to find where is the opportunity. So that's why people tell me marketing is not important. I feel they're wrong. In fact, for you to choose marketing is also very good because marketing can go to any areas. Right? You know, every company needs marketing, right? Yeah. Right? Similarly, like every company is accountant. Is it? So marketing is a necessity. So it's just that you need to know how to find opportunity. Okay? So that's why we need to understand this. Okay? Right? So marketing. We are here to let our customer know, we reach our audience, attract our customer and generate leads. Okay, so that's a, that's a lot of things that you're going to cover. So basically, like all of you students, right, marketing students, I will call you marketing students, we have subjects to teach you everything about this. So that when you graduate that time, you are all rounder. Okay, and our subjects are all updated in terms of you look at our syllabus, there's no digital marketing, right? Because digital marketing is embedded into every of our subject. So that's why you go to a degree and say, oh, we have a digital marketing subject by itself. Then I say, it's not red logic. Because everything is, digital marketing is in everything. Every area of marketing. So how can you have one subject by itself? You see? So that's why we don't want to have a digital marketing by itself. We actually embed it into all our subjects okay all right so that's on that Am I, did i open the right correct right slide i think so sorry i i, I have not seen the slide to actually just to just to admit to you because nothing to hide actually i'm not supposed to be the one to present it because it's supposed to be doctor who has the other program monitor but then this morning she told me she can't make it so i just come and take so i have not seen the slide so I'm seeing the slide the first time as you. Alright? So we explore together, right? Yeah? I, I, I don't want to be like some people say a oh, marketing people can do boring and simply say things or not. I'm very transparent. I don't know, I will say I don't know. Because customer, if you lie them to them once, that's it. Forever they don't trust you. So last time I remember when I was a, student, uh, a fresh graduate, fresh graduate uh, my, my boss told me, Vincent, no need to be so transparent. Uh. Alright? If you're so transparent, you cannot get your sales. That was how many years ago? That was 20 years ago. Nowadays, you're trying to, 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 to cheat and lie to your customer and say, the next moment they, they viral it and say bye bye, goodbye. Your name is affected. So we have to be very honest and transparent. Because, because the logic in this, as I imagine, uh, you go online, you want to buy a product. 
you don't get to see it, touch and feel the product. It's only based on the picture online. So the only thing, what makes you decide to buy the product because of the trust. So the trust is very important when it comes to marketing nowadays. Okay? So I'm just, okay? All right. So these are all the, according to what uh, the staff, this is the top, top, this uh, work, top jobs, huh? top most advertised vacancy for jobs. So you can see uh, marketing is there. Marketeer is always in there because all companies need marketing people. Alright, sales manager, alright, and then of course they need teachers, all these things. Accountant is there because every company needs accounting people. So marketing is the next one. Right? That's why if I don't believe if you have a marketing degree, you cannot get a job. And I can share with you, it's not proven, but something that I share with you. Usually students who go for internship after our degree, they will be highly uh, high chance they being absorbed to be the full-time staff. But unless the company say I cannot absorb because why I got over staff. Alright? So that is the only answer. So that's why when you come to an internship, make sure you choose the right company. Don't simply go intern anywhere that you want. Choose the right one that you think you can build a career there. Okay. All right. So this is the top skills. All right. Analytical, active learning, problem solving, so critical thinking, or creativity. All these basically, ladies and gentlemen, I can tell you all our subject have this critical thinking, problem solving, uh, creativity, leadership. Because you are going to work as a group. All right. You need to use technology. You need to be very resilient because sometimes assignment. Deadline is very, very uh, impossible to achieve, but no choice, you have to fulfill it. Yeah, That's what company are does like uh, that. When you start working, they give you impossible deadline, but you have to do it, right? So mm -hmm. same thing. So we actually emphasize on that students need to fulfill the deadline. Alright? And then specialized skill, we have product marketing, we have product planning, right? Digital marketing, as I said, we don't have specific subject, but digital marketing is embedded throughout all our degree. We have uh, software, we have programming as well, you need to study. Business management, advertising, right? uh, human computer interaction, we have technology, we have to know how to use technology. Development tools, data storage technology, computer networking, web development. So basically, out of these uh, 10 topics, maybe 6 to 7 of it is in our degree. So basically, don't worry, our degree is, uh, is very highly quality, so don't worry of not able to get a job. Alright, so these are the top jobs that we have. So basically, ladies and gentlemen, after finishing the degree, you can actually go into a lot of this creativity, creative industry, because you can design product, you can uh, conduct data analysis to get data to, to come up with the best product and services. Okay, digital marketing, AI, project management, UX user experience, cyber security, and data analysis, and data storytelling. So nowadays, analytics, we don't call analytics sound so technical, we call it data storytelling. You can see the data, and the data will tell you a story. Whether what are you doing correctly, or are you doing wrong? Or what are you doing well? So data tells you all that. So you can venture into that. So not necessarily marketing is to sales. Huh? Marketing can also be doing data analysis. You are analyst. I have students who actually become analysts because their job is to analyze data. Then I have, I have, come, I have students who graduated, they become entrepreneur. They start their own venture. Right? So many things actually, there's all this. Okay? All right, so now let's come to the most challenging. That one is all the story to tell you that marketing is not a degree that is outdated. It's in fact uh, being updated as we go on. Alright, so in future we'll tell you why you must take a degree in marketing and then you can answer them all these things. Marketing is not just sales. Marketing is the backbone of the company. Without marketing, your business will not survive. Because of all the hope, I'm not bragging, huh? you look and after your degree you sit down and reflect and see all the business like accounting, uh, uh, finance, 
right? Customer service, all these are cost center, means they don't earn profit, they eat up cost. The only department that brings in profit is where? Marketing. Because we get customer, we get sales for you, right? All these departments are our support. Accounting is our support. We are the face of the company. We go and sell. We go and talk to customer. So among all, marketing is the one that is the profit center. Is that? Uh, so be proud that you are a marketing student. People tell you why marketing, marketing can take course only one. But then course is only teaching you this part. A degree will tell you the whole story. Like we will tell you from principal marketing until the advanced marketing. The whole story. Okay? So basically your degree is divided to four areas. Compulsory courses, which is the common one which with all the degrees. Then common core, this is the core subject for our marketing. This is discipline core. Elective, this is the choice that you can choose. And industrial training, six credit hours. So you need to go for internship, 12 weeks of internship. All right. And this internship, for this case, you can always put it at the last semester. So then after you finish your internship, you can continue as long as you want. All right. So we don't want you to do your internship, then come back to take one more semester. Finish up, go and work up, right? So that's our internship. Okay, what is our common core? I don't know whether you can see this, but you can see it when, from this black book. All right? Uh, these are all the subjects that is given to you, yeah? So basically, ladies and gentlemen, yeah? You need to follow strictly this progress structure. All right, if you fail any of this, touch wood, uh, if you fail any of this subject, the chances of you getting the subject next semester is very low because most of the time the subjects offer once a semester, once a year, sorry, or maybe the most is twice a year. It will not be offered every semester. So follow your course structure uh, uh, strictly. That what Dr. Hasni, our deputy, did say, you need to print this and paste it on your wall or at your folder or whatever that you can see every semester you need to make sure you take the correct one and the second thing you need to remember is make sure you take the correct code huh? because there are some subjects the code is almost the same okay so year one year two and year three as you can see trimester this trimester three will be your internship you did not put here okay all right so these are your elective courses. You can see that you can choose from these four choices here, you can choose two. Then this one you can choose one of these four choices. And this one you can choose one of these one cho three choices. Choice. So if let's say you like to learn about relationship marketing, then you choose relationship marketing. Because nowadays businesses relationship very important. Right? Can you tell me one business that don't maintain relationship with you? None. All maintain relationship with you. So you need to know how to what are the what are the strategy, what are the framework that helps you to manage your relationship with customer. So you follow this framework, then all these things are covered. Okay? Because nowadays you don't know. So you have all this framework. So in our subject will teach you the framework. Okay? Then if you want to talk about change. Yeah, everything is changing. One thing is constant, ladies and gentlemen. In this world, one thing is constant, is change. Every day we are changing. So you need to embrace change. And how to embrace change is through innovation. You need to come up with new ideas, new methods, new way of doing things. Okay, so that's trimester one. Trimester two, we have social media marketing. If anyone of you like social media, then we teach you about all the social media uh, concepts. Theory of inventing, problem solving, event marketing, those of you into organizing events, then you can take event marketing. Then you want to know about technology, you can take about digital media. Now this ladies and gentlemen, I like to highlight you to this uh, free elective. Now this free elective is we basically call it the BYOC, build your own curriculum. You can take any subject from other faculty. If let's say you don't like all this, you go and see maybe you want to take FCM sub subject. Faculty of Creative Media. So you can take a subject from that. As long as it's three credit hours. Okay? Yeah, done. Alright, so this is our academician, very few. So we only have two, four, six, seven 
our number of the vision getting lesser. So initially, I remember when I started here, we have 12. Now it becomes 7. Alright, so this is a uh, uh, this is Dr. Noasi, the program coordinator. Okay, then we have uh, Dr. Sun. So this is Dr. Tan, is more towards product. product. Dr. Abdullah is more towards uh, research and analytics. Dr. Ara is basically on strategy. Then Dr. Jun is basically on uh, principle of marketing. And Dr. Nasri more of communication. And me, I'm just nothing, I'm just everything. Uh, uh, me here, uh, the last one. Okay. So for me, uh, I'm just all rounder. Like, I can try to do everything. Like, so, uh, can do everything but master none. Yeah, but where else is the least all master something? Like. Okay? So what activities we have so ladies and gentlemen in our subjects we don't try not to have all the time classroom. We want it to be two-way communication and also we also organize event activities for all students. Every semester there's activities. Okay? So this is when they create a board game. Okay? Then uh, after bring, create the board game, you can bring the board game to go test market testing. Go and go to schools and let students test your board game, product testing. Okay, and then you go for competition. Uh, this is the CEO of a uh, of a company, so he gives the prize to the students. Okay, and this is the sample of prototype. And then one, I think one of the board game is now commercialized. They actually sold it. Right, then we also have a uh, competition. Alright, we, we uh, pitching. Now you see this picture? Students pitching to investors. We alright, so we get to be uh, what? Celebrity uh, pitching your ideas to, to investors. If that's it, the investor like your idea, then they will give you investment. Okay? Then you can start your business, no problem. Okay. So this is what they said uh, in marketing, we said don't find customer for your product, find product for your customer. So that what you understand right here. Last time we have product that only look for customer. But now we look for customer then create product for the customer. Find product for your customer. I say okay, you are my customer now, I go and get to know you, then I see what's your problem, then I create a product for you. Last time I have product, now my product is good, bye, bye, bye. Now different, now the other way around. Ask customer what they want. Because, because why? Customer have too many choice. Alright? Last time you go to school, right? I don't know, all of you locals, Malaysians, right? So you go to school, you only wear uniform, right? The, the school uniform. So I remember last time when I go to school, shoes is only one type, bata. Now you go to a shop and see how many types of school shoes. Okay? Why? Because this company, they ask the student, do you like Bata shoe? No, la, Bata not nice, la, not cool enough. La. So they design new one for them. So that's why they said, find product for your customer. What your customer want, create for them. Not you create them, only ask them to buy. That is old school. Okay? Then marketing is the generous act of helping someone to solve a problem. So you are problem solver. You try to solve your customer's problem. Alright? Okay? That's why you make our life better. Make our the life of our customer better. Okay? Alright. So doing business, we are advertising like winking at the girl in the dark. Or they say if you have a good product but you do not do advertising or marketing, it's like you winking to a girl in the dark. The girl don't even know what you're winking at him. The girl don't even know that you're winking at her. Because it's so dark. So marketing is to give light so that people know your product. Okay? You know what you are doing but nobody else does. You know you have a product but no one knows. So marketing is there. So that's why I'm going to tell you why you take a degree in marketing. You say, uh, if we are marketing, how do you know product is there? It is us marketing going to bring the product to your awareness. If there's no marketing, you won't even know about this product. If there's no marketing, you won't even know my MMUs in, in this is here. Am I right? If you don't have advertising, you don't even know bachelor of marketing, am I right? So marketing is important. Right? So be be proud of it. So whenever I go people, people say, oh, Vincent, what do you take in your what is your specialization? Marketing. Oh, 
proud. They say, oh, marketing easy. I say, no, you try and do and say, now this is not easy as in like that. It's becoming complex. Okay? We last time when I studied, one strategy for everyone here, but now this cannot. One strategy for each of you. Right? We are now creating one strategy for each of you, not one strategy for everyone here. Okay? Almost finishing. So with that, thank you. Alright, now before I go, just want to ask you, before I go, before you all go. Alright? Uh, like I said, I'm very happy to see all of you. Like I said last time when I was a program coordinator, the number of students sitting in this room is only three or four or even one. Yeah. Now, why do this happen? Because they, they think that there's a perception saying marketing is not important. All right? But bear in mind, marketing is a stepping stone for your whatever in future you want to do. It's a good stepping stone. Okay? Because marketing can go to different different areas. You see? All right, so what was what, the time now? What was the time this need to go up? Uh, 11. 11, okay. All right, so now, my, now I said I finished talking. Now your turn to talk. Uh, because bear in mind, all of you are going to be the, in the same class for three years. Sometimes, most some of the chances you could be in the same room for three years. All right. Now, what I'm going to share with you, I may sound very negative, yeah. I have cases where students, they can't work together as a group, yeah. But no matter how ladies and gentlemen, group assignment is very important because when you go out to work, you cannot choose your colleague. Can you choose your colleague? You cannot, right? The only way for you to choose your colleague is to, for you to resign. But too many times resigning is not good for your CV. So you need to know how to work together. So with that, I hope that today you will start the kick ball, uh, kick start the ball, make the yeah, let the ball rolling by letting you all get to know each other. You all know each other? Yeah. Only that's why sit together like buddy buddy again. The, the ladies also buddy again. Like. That's why they sit. But anyway, no problem. Now we do marketing now. Let's start practicing marketing today. Now, so now I give you like uh, thirty seconds. Yeah, think. What is your marketing talk? How are you going to market yourself to your friend? What you want to tell your friends? And these friends are going to be you for three years. So how do you want to create your tone? How do you want to create your image? Uh, 30 seconds. Okay? Uh, you want to sing, you want to dance, it's up to you. Lah. As long as you create your image. Right? Just now I started my tone by being very strict like oh cross to the lecture room here. Okay. Any question from all of you? Okay. Huh? Marketing's like that one. Huh? Yeah. I still remember last time when I was student, we are, I'm very shy. Then one, you know what why I become not shy now is why? Because my lecturer told me one thing. Vincent, yeah. If you say wrong, people laugh, you laugh louder. Yeah? But doing wrong is part and parcel of life and you improve from that so don't be shy wrong wrong lah. marketing people face must be thick lah. right so your face must be thicker compared to other degree program because you are marketing people okay all right i think 30 seconds over who would like to start first volunteer no you know volunteer there i choose lucky number one lah. You know, last, when I start, if you come to my class, I will start the class by same thing, all right? To introduce yourself and market yourself and see what is your, what is your stand when it comes to group assignment. So some students, they say, I'm very serious my group assignment. I'm very important, my important thing is deadlines. I'm very good in, I ma manage my deadline very strictly. So whoever likes that method, join him. Oh, that, that group. The group, the, the leader said, Oh, I want to be the group leader. Okay, this is my requirement when you are in my group. Then everyone join him, the one that likes his method join him, and their group do well. So that is called marketing. You tell people what who are you. Okay, all right, enough for me talking. Let's start. Who would like to start first? Uh, the temperature is also very cold, and then you become very nervous. Butterfly is summer, then you feel like you cannot control your body. Right. Don't worry. 
it's not an exam. Who would like to start first? No. No, no. Uh, yes, please, oh, please. Yeah. Please, uh, yeah. Guys, he is going to be your group member soon. Oh, he can't try good. Hello. Uh, I am Faris. Um, I am 19. I am... Well, I like to procrastinate. I'm not gonna lie. But, I do make sure I finish my work. That's one thing. So, you know, if you want to be in a group with me, I will get my work done. Just don't expect it, you know, too early. Um, I'm a very chill person. I don't like care about too many things. Like you want to do what you want, do what you want. Um, I am really passionate about music. So if you want to vibe with me on music, I'm always down. And I do like sports a lot. And that's me. Where are you from? Uh, school or where are the best your hometown? Uh, my dad's hometown is in Kedah. And yours? I don't have a hotel, so it's everywhere. So, where is your last school? Where do you study? Help me, help me see you. Oh, I also found help. Okay, okay. So, any hobby? Um, hmm. Music. Oh, music, good. Uh, our our niece did need a lot of music people. Maybe you can start joining and, and, and shine from there. Yeah. I remember you, music time. So sometimes we, we our faculty need music to serve and pass you. Right? Any more questions from him? Don't be shy. Your chance to ask him questions. Yes. What sport do you do? Uh, I do. I used to do a lot, but I'm really now into more like the basketball and football. Can join in to play football. <laughs> Anyone like football here? Yeah? No? Basketball? No, okay, yeah, they can, can join, can get together and play some three on three. To watch my school. Or two on two. Okay, one on one, not two on two, one on one. You watch basketball? Sorry. You watch basketball? Uh, watch and play. What team? Uh, you mean NBA team? Yeah, I mean. Uh, I like, I love Golden State Warriors. <laughs> Too busy. <laughs> oh, okay. Then I can can later on discuss with him. Good. All right. Any more questions from him? If not, then let him sit down. Then go to the next. Maybe let him choose the next person. <laughs> Do I need to choose? I choose. Okay. All right. Thank you, Paris. Okay. Now we know him a bit more. Yeah. So who would like to go next? Maybe. No need to come in front. Of, sit at your place. No problem. It's okay. I just. Ah, yeah. Come. Okay, uh, hello everyone. Uh, my name is Mohamed Faiz, and you can call me Faiz. And I am 22 years old. And currently, I'm really sorry that my English is not good. So, um, if uh, we want to work together in a uh, work assignment, uh, I can get the jobs done. Yeah. I'm not a leadership on yeah. And my hobby is filmmaking, videography. Oh, and videography, the yeah, book, yeah. Of a wedding. Wow. Yeah. I can ask you, do you have a Instagram or anything that we can have a photo? Yeah. Okay. So, so later we can get the from you. Under SSM. Oh good. Then, then then we can ask your expertise. Oh, good. Oh, we need people like him, we need people like you also. Yeah. So anybody to ask? Any question? Any question? Yeah. No question, no problem. Yeah. Where are you from? Uh I'm from Kara. Kara. Yeah. Where is your last place of study? You attend Chala. Okay, okay. Before my field. Go by flame. Uh, then why you choose one thing? Why you never choose AC? My previous company uh, in wedding industry. 
ini marketing. Oh. Yeah. So all around the yeah. marketing. Uh, okay. Okay. So I think oh, most of the really want marketing. So I need to learn about marketing. If let's say if let's say our our faculty we have a social media team, right? I ask you to join with you in building because. Now carry our social media is only lecturer, no student. So 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 lecturer back of time. So if you are there, maybe you can teach us. Okay, I will remember you. Okay, thank you. Alright, next please. We go order la yeah. Um, hello everyone, my name is Ka Hao. Uh, if, uh and I am 20 years old la, this year. Uh, actually, I'm from Selangor, which is uh, near to MMU also, so I do not stay in the hostel, but just drive here every day. And then, uh, uh, if as for the assignment, the group assignment, uh, actually, I do not like to procrastinate, so I will like, do the work uh, early, and then we can enjoy and relax later. And then, you procrastinate, no problem, you find a group leader that control you, that's it. Uh, and then uh, if you want to work with me, uh, you sure you can uh, we can do so and uh, we can know each other more and then I I believe that we will all achieve our goals in these three years with very uh, fine colors. Very good talk. <laughs> My <laughs> motivating oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> My hobby is play basketball as I said just now and then I usually watch or play basketball during my free time. Okay. Any more questions for our friend here? No? No? Okay, never mind. Later, keep it later. No question, never mind. Alright, thank you. Next, please. Yes. This is going to be your classmate for three years. Hi guys, uh, my name is Ali and I'm from India. Uh, I was born and raised in Qatar and uh, actually stay here nearby Tierra Villa and uh, I'm into car videography and uh, I worked uh, in a car showroom for almost two years in Qatar. Any more questions for our friend? No? What kind of videography do you do? Uh, car, mostly, mostly car. Oh, mostly car. car. You also car? Um, not really. <laughs> okay, no, okay, sometimes okay. nature. Mm -hmm. because, because ladies and gentlemen, doing video content is very important. Part and parcel, it needs a, it's a skill that you need to know. Okay, good. Thank you. Okay, very good. So now let's go uh, to our lady of me. Thank you. 
badminton and playing piano. Oh, so you need background music, you ask yeah. music for you. Uh, and then, and then you, need, you, need, you need a, a, a personality like talking, uh, you can ask him to be your spokesperson. Okay, yeah. I'm quite bubbly. Yeah, bubbly is very bubbly. So, yeah, that's all about it. Good, good. Uh, you have the team of, of videographer, content creator here, uh, all different different skills. Uh, we have his skill, we have his skill, your skill. Uh. Alright, next please. Um, hello guys, my name is Muhammad Bay Aki. You guys can call me Aki. I'm 22 this year. Oh. And I'm from Petroleum. Oh, right, yeah. I'm from here today. And I like I like uh, to watch football oh. and I can play music a little bit. Yeah. Okay, okay. Then it can be one of the talents also. Tall, tall, attractive look. Yeah. Now these people look at this. Uh. Yeah. Okay, any more questions for you? Where are you from? Um, Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Oh, okay. So means your school is Puerto Rico. Yeah. Okay, okay, good. Thank you. Next please. Uh, Hello, my name is Azra. I was born in Indonesia, mm. but I was raised here. Okay. Yeah, and in terms of assignment purposes, I'm also very flexible. If I have to finish up early, I will do so, or I sometimes procrastinate a little bit as well. My normal part and parcel of procrastinating. Yeah, um, for hobbies, I do. I watch football too. Mm. I watch Formula One, oh. and I also like traveling. Traveling. Okay. Okay. Good. This is traveling. They can ask her uh, to content on traveling. Not really much of a concept person, though. I can talk to you. He's a concept <laughs> designer. Okay. Good. Thank you. We have multi skilled multi talent multi background person, individual. What about you? So we need a lot of talent like all of you. TikTok, yeah. Deputy student engagement. We 
because he is going to go into this content. So maybe you can connect with Dr. Abdullah. Yeah. So so I will introduce, I will tell him about you all, and then he will meet all of you to see what can how can we work together. And this can be your credential. So when you graduate that time, the university acknowledge your capability. Yeah. Okay, good. Any more things? Also I like to review like PKs. Oh see, see, see. But this, this, uh, this is very red talent. If you uh, you can express well, that's very important. Okay, now I know. Yeah. You can start the team now. All right, thank you. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry for being. No problem. Academic that time when I come here is too too far lah. 
for my publication, my research, everything. Then they come in, oh, okay, you can be lecturer, okay. So, so for your case, I don't think you want to be academician, right? You want to be out there earning big bucks, right? You want to be the next next uh, Jack Ma, next Malaysian Jack Ma, next Malaysian Elon Musk, right? So you have to go out also. So to do that, you need to have the skill. Right? But remember, when you become Malaysian Jack Ma or Malaysian Elon Musk, you don't forget me. Right? Don't forget me. Remember us. At least give me a bit of what you earn is good enough. Like Jack like Elon Musk, uh, millions. Uh. So he give me one million of his, his uh, wealth, uh, it's like nothing. You know? One million is enough for me. Yeah, but sadly, he don't know me. Like, if he know me, if he knows me, I will ask him, "Hey, long ones, can you give me one million? And it's just only a tiny fraction of your wealth." Is it? Like, like today, I, I, I read the newspaper. Elon Musk just lost sixteen million. Just like that, sixteen million, just like that. That's like. Ask me to lose 100 million, I feel hard. This is 16 billion. Is it? Okay? Alright, guys, uh, I, I do not think I'm done. It is exactly 11 pm. Yeah? So uh, I hope you will enjoy your session, your years with us. Alright? And then again, uh, I show you the academics here. Alright? I will show you the academic here because you need to connect with all of us. Uh, this is Dr. Abdullah. Yeah, he's going. He's in charge of the student, uh, the social media, everything. So those of you interested, I can introduce you to him. All right, this is Dr. Ara, Dr. Jun, Dr. Nasri. All of us, uh, academic in marketing unit, very small. So we are very close to our students. Right? We know our students very well. Right? So you are going to be our our close uh, group. Okay. 